Well, here I am standing in the parking lot. Stanford Inn is over there. There's the first red building. There's the second red building. And there is the door you're going to want to look for, right in the middle of the second red building facing the river. Park anywhere you like in this parking lot. It's handy if you can back into a spot by the door. The locks are shoveled for you here. So these are our units here, 512 and 510. There's the lockers. We'll be using the middle one, which is 512. The key for that is on the kitchen counter. There's the lock, it's simple to operate. Just enter in your code. Then turn the lock, turn the locks, and in you go. There is the condo. Just take off all your shoes at the door and leave your skis in the ski locker. So this is lock off number one and it's associated bathroom. And there's an ironing board back here for you to use. There's a heater which controls the heat in this room only. Please turn it off when you leave so you don't waste any power. This is the main living area, kitchen. There's a microwave, there's the wine opener. There's some cutting boards, there's all the spices you'd want. And in the fridge, that's cleaned out, but we left you a bunch of condiments. So if you want to cook, you don't have to buy all that stuff. You can use whatever you like. This is the deck. To get out there, you just have to remove the stick over there. And uh, please return the stick and lock the door when you leave. There is the internet router. The network name is my last name, which is Genj, G-E-N-G-E. -E. Password is CD4321DCBA, all lowercase. There's a phone, you're welcome to use to call home. Uh, it's toll free anywhere in North America. It's an internet phone, so you get what you get. There's the Apple TV. TV uh, has two inputs. One is the Apple TV and one is the uh, Shaw PVR. To switch them, there's a button right here beside the power button that switches between the two inputs. Just touch that button and it will switch. There's a Bose player that you can put your uh, old style iPhone in. The new ones will not work in that one, but a crib board for your use, a couple of sitting chairs, and the master suite. There's a closet for you with a luggage folder over there and lots of room for you to hang out in here. There's the bathroom and there's extra supplies down here and some band-aids in case you cut your finger. There's some shampoo and soap, you're welcome to use those or bring your own, as you like. There is a closet for all of your jackets and stuff. And there's a couple towels you can use to wipe down skis or whatever, if you need to use those. They're not good for bathing, but you can use them as a rag, basically. And then this is the basement. The lights are fluorescent, so they do take a little while to warm up. And then this is the downstairs bedroom. Kind of small, but it's a double closet there for your use. There's also a heater located inside the closet in case it gets cold in here. Please return that there if you decide to use it. Then there is a nice big living room down here. Really good for the kids to hang out. There's hide to bed number one, hide to bed number two, and a TV, and inside that TV cabinet is the bedding for these beds. So 
There's also more comforters and stuff located in the downstairs bedroom. This is the furnace room. You should not need to go in there. There is an auxiliary heater down here that you can use if the basement is cold. Please turn that off when you leave as well. There's a bathroom down here with lots of towels and in there is extra supplies. There's also some shampoo you're welcome to use in there. This is the laundry room, but it is locked. There's also a storage room here, which is also locked. And there is another cupboard in the kitchen, which is locked. So there is the place. Lots of room for lots of people. You can come here and go skiing and hiking, and fishing, whatever you want, and have fun. Anyways, that's all for now. Enjoy your stay at Heaven's Gate Condo. Take care. Any questions, problems, give Greg a call at 403-630-8818. Or the neighbors next door, Ryan and Corey, are very helpful. They're in 514, right outside your door. They're usually around, uh, except for during the day. And um, they can help you with whatever you need. Anyways, take care.